We welcome you today to Destiny's Church in Brossard, and we're very happy to have you via uh, internet. I hope today you'll be uh, worshiping and, and praising the name of the Lord. Come and receive today. There's a portion of scripture that I would like to read from you. It's Psalm 71, verse 20 to 21. It says this, Though you have made me see troubles, many and bitter, you will restore my life again. From the depth of the earth, you will again bring me up. You will increase my honor and comfort me again. Learned a lot of lessons from them. Thought it would destroy you or make you sick, but you come to help and you came to rescue and you came to deliver us so that we can serve you in a different way. But Lord, we ask, oh God, we thank you that in this time that was difficult, you came to see us. Let's just pray. Father, we thank you that it is Father's Day. We thank you that you are the Father of all. We thank you that it is the, our Father's world. It is the day that you have made. We will rejoice and we will be glad in it. Father, have you waited today for those who are suffering this morning, that you would meet their needs, oh God, for those who've gone through terrible moments and time because of COVID, that you would this morning touch them and the inner person. Father, have you way in this service, we ask in Jesus' name. Amen. Let's just uh, do... What we're supposed to do is to lift up the name of the Lord this morning. Amen? Amen.
Hallelujah. For the day is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. In Psalm 46, verse 10, it says, Be still and know that I am God. He's the center of it all. I will be exalted in all the nations. I will be exalted on the earth. Amen. the center of it all Jesus at the center of it all from beginning to the end it will always be it's always been you Jesus Jesus Hallelujah, hallelujah this morning. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Take me past the other courts and through the holy place, past the brazen altar. Lord, I want to see your face. Pass me by the crowds of people, the priests to sing their praise, the hunger and thirst I 
of your righteousness But it's only found one place So take me in to the Holy of Holies Take me in by the blood of the Lamb So take me in to the Holy of Holies Take the cold, cleanse my lips and here I am Take me past the other courts and through the holy place, past the brazen altar. Lord, I want to see your face. Pass me by the crowds of people, the priests who sing their praise. I hunger and thirst for your righteousness, but it's only found one. So take me into the Holy of Holies Take me in by the blood of the Lamb Take me into the Holy of Holies Take the cold, cleanse my Psalm 69, it says, Save me, O God, for the waters have come up to my neck. I sink in the miry depths where there is no uh, hold. I have come to the deep waters. The flood engulfs me. Rescue me from the mire. Do not let me sink. Deliver me from those who hate me from the deep, deep waters. Don't let the flood water engulf me or the depth swallow me up, or the pit close its mouth over me. Answer me, O Lord, out of the goodness of your love and your great mercy turn to me. Amen. Hallelujah. You call me out upon the waters, the great unknown, where feet may fail. And there I find you in the mystery, and oceans deep, my faith will stand. Your grace 
place abounds in deepest waters your sovereign hand will be my guide where feet may fail and fear surrounds me you've never failed and you won't start now My soul will rest in your embrace, for I am yours, and you are mine. Spirit, lead me where my trust is with My soul will rest in your embrace, for I am yours, and you are mine. Spirit, lead me where my trust is without borders let me walk upon the water wherever you would call me take me deeper than my feet could ever wander and my faith will be made stronger in the presence of my savior soul to amazing grace this morning. Amen. Sound. 
can see you now Oh, I can see the love in your eyes Laying yourself down Raising up the Take our failure, you take our weakness, you set your treasure in jars of clay. So take my heart, Lord, I'll be your vessel, the world to see your life in me. Raising up the broken to these pieces broken and scattered in mercy gathered mended and whole empty handed but not forsaken I've been set free I've been set been set free and we're no longer slave to fear this morning With a melody You surround me with A song Of deliverance From my enemies Till all my fears Are gone I'm no longer asleep From my mother's womb, you have chosen me. Your blood flows 
hope that this morning praise and worship really blessed you. I would like to end with a couple of uh, verses of the Bible, and we're going to end in prayer. O oh Lord, you have searched me and know me. You know when I sit and when I rise. You perceive my thoughts from afar. You discern my going out and my lying down. You are familiar with all my ways. If I go up to the heavens, you are there. If I make my bed in the depth, you are there. If I rise on the wings of the dawn, if I settle on the far side of the sea, even there your hand will guide me. All the days ordained are there for me. In your book, before one of them came to be. Lord, we thank you for another day, a day of praise, a day of worship, a day of healing, a day of deliverance, a day of receiving from you, a day where we could forget about everything else and give you your rightful place. We thank you that it is Father's Day. I pray for all the fathers this morning who are home those who are in need, those who are in need of a job, those who are in need physically or emotionally. We ask, oh God, that you would bless all the fathers. And we ask, Lord, that we, rem we are reminded today that you're the father of this world. Father, have you way today in the name of Jesus. Have a great day, and may the Lord bless you. Amen.